Rose was badgering me about going up to London again. But she's been enough lately, don't you think? I certainly do. After all, she's got to have some novelty when we bring her out. Quite right. She can help with the bazaar. That'll take her mind off things. Trouble is, parenting an adult, especially when it's someone else's daughter, is really a matter of mutual agreement. There's a limit to how much one can simply forbid. Shh. Here she is. Actually, I want a word with her. Rose, darling, can I drag you into my room for a moment? Anna, could you leave us for a minute? Of course. This is early for you to go to bed. I had a rather tiring day. So I heard. Well, I heard you had an interesting day. Whether or not it was tiring, you know better than I. Who told you? My dear, all I want is for you not to lose control of your life. I love him. And I, I won't listen to any imperialist nonsense about racial purity and how he should be horsewhipped for daring to dream. Don't you know me better than that? I'm going to marry him, Mary. And I don't care what it costs, and I won't keep it a secret. Not once I've told Mummy. I want to see her face crumble when she finds out. Rose. Is Mr. Ross here yet? Who shall I say is calling? Rose's cousin. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da ba da ba da. Da ba da da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da da. Lady Mary. I was wondering if it would be you. How did you know someone was coming? Rose telephoned. She said she told you we were about to set the date. I just made some tea. Would you like a cup? Thank you. I suppose you're here to say that Lord Flintshire would find the prospect of a black son-in-law preposterous. <laughs> <laughs> and your father would agree. To be fair to Papa, he'd find your being a band singer even harder to swallow than your color. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Ross, are you sure about this? Marriage is a challenge, even when everyone wants it. Even if everyone prays, you'll be happy. You mean in our case, they'll all be trying to pull us apart? Every hour of every day. Tell me. Do you think she loves you? Don't you believe in us? I believe in you. I'm not so sure about her. She may love you a bit, but mostly I'd say she wants to shock her mother, whom incidentally she hates. That's what my mother said. She said Rose must be proving some point. <laughs> you and my mother have a lot in common. Tell me honestly. Do you think you can survive what they'll do to you? Because I don't believe Rose could. It may come as something of a relief for you to hear that I will not be marrying Rose. You won't? No. I've enjoyed her dreams. I think she's more than you allow. But? I don't want to spoil her life. I don't want to watch while people point at her and jeer. I love her. I want her to be happy. So you'll end it? Yes. I should probably have stopped it sooner, but at any rate, I'm stopping it now. So will you tell Rose, or shall I? I'll tell her. I'll write to her. She'll get it tomorrow. It doesn't mean I think it's right. I wouldn't give in if we lived in even a slightly better world. 
It may surprise you, Mr. Ross, but if we lived in a better world, I wouldn't want you to. 